Brett. Some people call me the Amtrekker. You guys know the story already. But do you know the whole story? Every year in Carruthers, California, not so very far from where I was born, there's an annual flat track dirt bike race. The Carruthers Nationals. The interesting thing? Bikes of all sizes are racing. What better way to cross number 13 off my list? Hopefully without breaking a limb. I'm number 10. If you have trouble spying me, look for the guy that's awkwardly large for his bike and doesn't know how to ride it. So that was literally my first time ever on a dirt bike and I just got worked by a bunch of eight-year-olds in a practice round. I have no idea how I'm going to not look like an idiot in the real thing. So here's hoping. No, time out, cut. Let's just skip to the end of the race and I'll add around everything else so it looks like I'm right there in the running. And uh, that way in the final cut, I just won't tell you guys that it looks like I'm in the running because I just got laughed. All right, we're about to head out to the main event. I qualified in third on the sec on the first race, but it's because there are only three races. Hey! So wish you luck. Then I caught a break when either an intense Amtrekker fan or fate herself blew my toughest competitor's tire, guaranteeing me at least second place as long as I finish the race. Thanks to the magic of editing, I could just show you guys the first bit and the last bit and then let you draw your own conclusions and hopefully I'd look like a little less of a schmuck. Sadly, things went down a little more like this. But bear in mind, I wouldn't even have to let you see that what really happened was that I had several missed shifts or that just as I was getting comfortable I pushed my lack of skills just a little too far and one more crash later I wasn't able to start the bike back up quickly enough for then getting lapped. Again. This time by the only dude racing against me. Still, second place, right? When round the bell finishes the second position. I recognize that I have no business being disappointed right now because that was literally the first, second, third time I've ever even sat on a dirt bike before, but that's still the most embarrassing second place I've ever gotten. I can't believe how frustrated I am right now, even though I did pretty well for a guy that's never been on a bike before. So I guess I just need a little more practice. Or I need to stop picking on people my own size and start setting my sights a little lower. The big problem there is that even the little kids could wipe the floor with me. 